Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back. Hope we're all having a great day today and we're all doing well. So once again, thanks to Lythron Gaming, um, they're the same person that gave us a look at what the upcoming eSport weapon skins are going to look like. They actually gave us a look at what the newly updated Black Ice is going to look like. Now, for you guys who don't know, the Black Ice weapon skin was released in Operation Black Ice all the way back in year one as a seasonal skin for that season. Uh, then they re-released the weapon skin as a singular weapon skin. For all the weapons, it was available on on in the alpha packs. Now of course that was a long time ago and we've had so many new weapons since then and for you guys who don't know when a weapon gets released after a weapon skin uh, is released so the weapon skin comes before the new weapon that new weapon doesn't tend to get that older weapon skin. Now they're kind of changing it up a bit now they are updating a lot of the older weapon skins to be applied on newer weapons and it seems like they're finally doing that with black ice now. As you can see we are getting a look at what black ice looks like on a lot of weapons that released after Black Ice originally was released itself. So yeah, very cool to see on a lot of these weapons and I think it's quite nice um, for them to actually update it to a lot of the newer weapons as well because it's, you know, more than a seasonal skin, it's one of the most iconic skins from this game and you know it's yeah it's extremely iconic so it makes sense that now especially when we're getting a lot less new weapons per year to actually update probably the most iconic weapon skin in the game to all the other weapons um we've seen them do this in the past quite recently with the blood orchid skins they re-released them and then they also updated them to be applied on some of the newer weapons that weren't available back in operation blood orchid so honestly wouldn't be surprised if they start doing this with more seasonal skins in the future even if they release them or not um but i don't think they're going to re-release black ice as like a seasonal skin and like a universal it's obviously still going to be pack limited i think um 100 all these weapon skins are going to be thrown into the purple alpha pack as well but now instead of you know just them being limited to the vanilla and um operation black ice operators which is buck and frost you'll now be able to get them on every single operator after that so you know all the weapons like we've seen here like we've seen like the k1a seeing like jackal c7e you know you're seeing a lot of weapons which which we, you know, I've never seen Black Ice on before because obviously they came out after the weapon skin originally came out. Now we're getting to see it on there. And like I'm saying, this makes sense. Black Ice is literally the staple of Siege weapon skins, you know. When you think of Siege and you think of weapon skins, you think of Black Ice. So, yeah, 100%. This makes so much sense adding it to all the weapons. Um, I think it's going to be so cool, you know, now even opening packs saying like, oh my god, I can get Black Ice on any of these weapons and then hoping to get it for, you know, some of your favorite guns. I think that'd be so cool. Like, um, I'm not sure if Shields are in it yet. I don't think I noticed Shields in this video. Shield Black Ice were leaked, like, two years ago like there's like cheaters literally using it um but i assume they're part of this you know you don't update black ice to be available on every single weapon in the game and not give it to the shields even though the shields were like two years ago a hundred percent shields have got to be part of this but who knows maybe not but um yeah i just think it's so exciting to see this it looks nice on so many weapons like i think it looks especially nice on mavericks ar-15 and um, i just think it looks nice on all the weapons you know it's black ice you can't really go wrong with black ice but yeah i just do i do think it is nice you know being able to get it now for weapons which you know aren't just the same as before like i've had black ice on like the same russian pistol like 18 times now like to finally be able to at least have the chance to get it on some of my newer favorite operators it is really nice and i really do like this change I don't, I don't think people are actually asking for this but i don't think anyone is complaining that it's being added so yeah definitely a great change which i am welcome for hopefully they do this with more older skins as well update them let the newer weapons use them I think that'd be pretty cool. But yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below about Black Ice being updated to every single weapon in the game. Uh, we don't, we're not sure about Shield yet, but most likely, I think so. But yeah, drop a like on this video if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. Check out my Twitch linked in the description and my second channel. Uh, yeah, guys, have an incredible rest of your day. I love you all. Catch you all later. Peace.